morning. Say hello. Hello. What day is this day, Mark? The uh, 21st and we're going to NASA. And how excited are you for NASA? Pretty excited. <laughs> He's dumbing it down. He's been really excited all morning. It's Mark's favourite day. He's been talking about this the whole holiday. And he's brought all his money with him. So we're off to the Swan to get picked up. Um, 8, 10, pick up. And then it should take about an hour and a half to get there. And a little boy and Mark will come out. <laughs> Air blue in the distance. I can zoom in. The one down to Disney is down for his first one, so definitely not that. There you go. Just checked in for the bus tour and we've been given these, which is quite geeky. Mark, special interest tour. The only ones on the bus. <laughs> has everyone else gone on a, on, a, on a bus tour? Because we're on the ultimate tour. We're going to see Atlantis first. We've got our own bus tour at 1.30. How are you feeling? You're good. <laughs> That's a big smile. Go and see Atlantis. It's cool. Mark is doing something. What are you doing? Well, that's a challenger, the left side body panel. It's the Columbia cockpit windows. So we're in the rocket garden just for our lunch. An astronaut. Mark's walking about really much prior today. Kid in a candy shop. <laughs> lunch. Lunch. Let's eat. would jettison off the top of the capsule if the vehicle exploded and launch you to 500 mile an hour in three seconds which I don't think would do you much good to be honest. Saturn V, first one to the moon, used to get across onto the shuttles. Different suits. It's just a model of a T-38 training aircraft and Atlantis is over there, it's got the fuel tank and the rocket boosters. And that's the Atlantis building over there. That whole building with the orange band around it. We're off into the rocket garden. Someone says it's going to rain tomorrow so we might change our plans and not the type of it in. But it's all good. So 
school, how would you rate today? Oh, it's good, 10 out of 10. Do you think you recommend the ultimate tour that we did? Yeah. Was it compared to like if you just did the normal one? Um, think it's worth the extra money? Yeah, because you got to see the launch pads, but I don't think you do on the normal Oh, don't one, you? Okay. okay. And you got to dine. And yeah. you got dine, which I like quite, the Q&A was quite cool actually. Yeah, it was a good so. presentation and it wasn't yeah. boring. No, and the food was all right, so. Okay. Good. We're heading out. We're going back to the it was Disney Hotel. And then we're going to go and try a new Italian place on the boardwalk. We had a, a spare credit and we thought, let's try some menu. So we're going to go there and have some pasta and pizza. Pizza. I've got my carbonara and let's eat some food. So we just finished our meal. My dessert was nice. I had like a custard, um, a white chocolate custard dish, um, and Mark had ice cream. It was so cold in that restaurant. So cold. Ice cream probably wasn't the best idea, but um, yeah. And my main meal wasn't that great, but you liked yours, eh? Yeah, mine was fine. I wouldn't. I wouldn't get back personally. But, uh, so we're now heading back to the resort. It's like eight o'clock, but we're so tired. Mark, you might want to press the button for we'll lift because we're just saying. There's a new merch in the Beach Club um, hotel <laughs> shop and new Mark just mugged me. What's the matter? You can't say new merch in public. Well, really? it was like a nice little beach t shirt. I want it, but apparently got mugged. Yay. Right, we're back later. So I see you tomorrow. Ciao. <coughs>